And then, of course, everyone is excited for the uh, One Piece updates. Uh, let me tell you, uh, we're still in any's lobby. The Buster call has been initiated, and God damn, are things getting scary. I, I will say one thing. I think Nico Robbins' retribution was incredibly silly. I don't know why. I want to see, like, cut heads. I know that this is a shonen, and it's like, you know, its consumption is supposed to be for the broadest audience possible. It's for, like, children, you know what I mean? But I do want to see, like, like when Zoro beat, uh, when Zoro beats Kaku uh, with, like, the, the Asura, you know, nine-armed demon moveset. I'm just thinking to myself, like, I want to see a moment where he just fucking goes, Whoosh! And then, you know, Kaku is just, like, cut into pieces, turns into a fucking cloud of mist and dust, you know what I mean? And, and blood, pink mist. Like, I want that. I want that out of One Piece. I know it's probably not going to happen. Maybe it will. I think that third gear, finally, like, Luffy doing second gear, third gear, which is a, such an antiquated trope at this point in every anime. I'm glad that, like, uh, you know, I'm glad that that has, is happening. It's still goofy as fuck, as is the case with Monkey D. Luffy. His power is so fucking goofy. Like, his third gear is so goofy, bro. It's so fucking goofy. It, it's, it's, like, unimaginably goofy. I thought he was going to do, like, a AOT style. Like, he just bites in his fucking... He, he bites into his thumb, and then all of a sudden, he just becomes this, like, monster or some shit. Even Hunter Hunter has, like, going becoming, like, like, a jacked adult. You know what I mean? Like, looks cool. Luffy, on the other hand, still insanely goofy. Goofy ass motherfucker, no Super Saiyan shit whatsoever. Okay, so yeah, that's fine. It only gets goofier, probably. It's all good. I think like half of the reason why I don't like Usopp is because of his voice. Because now that he does the Sniper King voice, I do legitimately feel like he's a little bit cooler. Like the Sniper King when he talks with more with more uh, confidence. But like, it's a little bit better. I just hate how fucking insecure and how vulnerable and how weak he is. Oh, fuck, I spoiled it. That's my speculation. I don't know if Usopp is, is Sniper King. I don't know. I don't know if Usopp is Sniper King. It's, I just don't know. I just, that is my speculation, okay? Sorry, it's technically not a spoiler. We just don't know. We still don't know. It seems like they're different people, but like, I don't know. Now I'm starting to feel like they're the same person. Especially because Sanji and Zoro both call him uh, Usopp in this, in this episode. Luffy is a reference to the journey to the West. He has to be goofy as the Monkey King. Okay. Hit me up when we stop discussing the merits of children's cartoons. Brother, life is terrible overall. I don't know if you know that or not. We talk about it all day, every day. So if something that's like a little goofy uh, gives you a, a feeling of coziness that you can watch and like kind of tune out all of the other noise with, like why the fuck would you turn around and yuck that? You know what I mean? Why would you turn around and be like, no, nah, dog. Hit me up when we don't talk about children's cartoons. I mean, clearly a lot of people appreciate the, the One Piece updates, which is part of the reason why I do it. Uh, I'm not, like, defending it overall. Shut the fuck up. I'm not defending One Piece on main. If you don't want to watch it, don't watch it. It's not for everybody. I like that it's cozy. Personal news-wise, because I don't really do anything else, because I just work out and watch anime when I'm offline, that's all I talk about. Anyway, Fallow was good. One Piece was great. 